Hello. Uh, here I will show a standalone computer. Standalone computer. You may think, uh, hey, Arduino is already standalone computer. What are you saying? But uh, this small board has uh, the full interface and the really a standalone computer with video out. Uh, NTSC video out. It, it can also capable of up output the PAL that I use in the NTSC and uh, PS2 and the power supply. And uh, indeed, this is almost the dead copy of the original. And you can find original by Google search with the key keyword AVR com basic computer. AVR basic computer. Now let's plug in first uh, video, video, and uh, PS2, and uh, power supply. Now it is, uh, as you see, it is booting up, and uh, you can see on the screen, tiny basic plus version 0.14. And as you see, the user land is around 8 kilobyte. Now let's program like this. It's very simple com uh, program. Print A like that. And uh, 20 A equals to A plus 1. And uh, let's make infinite loop. And you can check by the list. And uh, let's run. As you see, it is running the uh, basic program. Actually, uh, not only the simple basic program uh, executor, but also uh, this small computer has the I/O controllable. The main chip is i80 Mega 1284, and it has a variety of interface. As you see, uh, D0 to D7, D up to D23. It has a digital interface up to 23 and also the analog input, AD converter input from A0 to A7, 8 analog input it has. And uh, this digital and the analog I.O. both of them are programmed by the basic program. For, for example, let's connect the LED, LED lamp. Uh, from first uh, D10 of the board to ground first LED and the second LED uh, let's connect D11 D11 to oops yes D11 to D10 and uh, let's program like this O A equals to for example zero to R sorry. Actually this basic does not have a backspace so if you put input the wrong program then you have to retype the same one. And uh, uh, list and 20 d right d right corresponds to the digital right and now the led first led is connected to the d10 so now here is a 10 and let's make it high level and uh, also we put another led which is a d11 so here now 11 low and ma let's make some delay for example, 250 millisec, and uh, <coughs> now uh, 50. Now the right. Let's make D10 to low, and 60. Let's make D11 to high, and uh, also now let's make some delay to 50 and 80 next a list yes and uh, let's make it long 
as you see, is blinking. And this blinking, uh, now, so again, this blinking is programmed by the basic. Not only their digital out, it has their analog input, uh, 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 analog input is also programmed by the basic program. Let's now new no list okay and uh, let's make a equals to a lead uh, for example three this means the the value for the analog input three a three on the chip a three here a three is uh, substituting the value a a lead is a and uh, simply uh, print a and r uh, okay thirty. Uh, let's make infinite loop go to ten. This okay. Then run. Actually, this is now leading some value and checking the value. Uh, for example, uh, a three here. And if I connected the ground, it goes down to zero. And uh, it's measuring some noise and some values. Uh, actually, the total cost of this small computer is around twenty dollar. It's very low cost computer, and it may be very useful for some education purposes. Have fun.